You are listening to The Last Dance Station. Get up, stand up on Energy 92.7 and 101.1. Okay, now, uh, here, I got to give you a little inside radio. Uh, Pete's been downstairs talking to a listener who yeah, stopped yeah. by for us to sign this T-shirt. And uh, I told Yvonne, our front desk uh, lady, to, to tell him that I needed you up here. And you didn't show up, so I upgraded to Christy, right, our promotions right, rep. Right, She's right. much more attractive than she, you. Well, yeah, yeah, she probably does a better job. <laughs> okay, wait a minute. Is this what's going on? What? Th- this was all a sham to get... You weren't supposed to figure it out until five. Okay. Oh yeah. She, she's my replacement. No, no. Energy's not going anywhere. I'm replacing you, you with Christy because she's much hotter. Nice. <laughs> you know, and I actually like tipped you at promotions, remotes. Yeah. Well, out of my talent fees, yeah. I threw you my own loot. She actually used that money to produce her air check to take your job. It's weird how that happens. So I walked in and I caught, I caught you too. Yeah. Red-handed. Nice. Yeah. Well. It happens. And so, the, is this the trick in the... The treat is for you. Yeah, of and course the treat treat's for me. me. Is, hey, thanks, but no thanks. Yeah, exactly. Thanks. Yeah, well, That's a cool one, dude. You know, but it's I, how I, I just, you know, at least have the satisfaction of being able to call that bluff. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I feel mm-hmm. fulfilled. Do you, do you feel do you, you feel like a complete ma- uh, person I now? I, I just, I know that... I Now I know. 
the <laughs> final day of Energy 927 <laughs> and 1011. There's some, somebody driving down the 10 right now going, did that really just happen? Did, you, did Bo really do that? Hey, yeah, and, and there's, there's some other dude going, oh, that sounds like Bo. Okay, there, there actually is a guy driving in. He's, he said he coming in, he's coming in from LA just because he wants to listen to the uh, That's last right. hour. He's in Tonopah. Yeah. I don't wow. even know where Tonopah is. Yeah, is that by the nuclear driving. plant? I don't know. I don't know. No, but he's no driving idea. in, and God bless him. And uh, yes, the we're passion. Counting down, we're, we're counting down the final moments of energy. In, in about 25 minutes from right now, energy is gone. And uh, what we've been doing since 10 o'clock this morning is very, very, very roughly. We've been taking a lot of liberties with it. Counting down the top 92 songs of all time. I think we've played a grand total of 25 of those 92. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Well, it's been a lot of phone calls today. <laughs> it's, it's quite all right. Nobody uh, ever said that we were math majors. No, 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 we no, work no, in radio. No, no. We're just trying to account. Uh, number two there, uh, P, while you were downstairs, was uh, Get Up Stand Up by Stellar Project. Obviously a big, big record for the radio station. Sure. Uh, did I show you this list? Did I tell you what number one was? I, I, I think you may have told me. I mean, I don't even know. Okay, but if I hadn't shown you this list, what would you think? Just being, being the fact that you were on the radio station for six years, what would you say the number one most played song ever on this radio station was? I would say was? DJ Sammy Heaven. You, you would say that? Yeah. It's got to be up there. Not even on the top 50. You're kidding. Not even on the top 50. Why? Because I, I remember that tune being yeah, one of the first tracks we played when we were on the air. Yeah. Not even, not even, not even on the first two pages. Lasco something. Uh, Lasco was down in the uh, 40 range. Wow. Uh, Christy, your replacement has an idea. What's Christy, what, do you, what are you saying? ATB? Don't Stop? No, it's not ATB. ATB Don't Stop doesn't even show up. Ecstasy is yes. Uh, you all suck. Forever? Uh, I, I feel like I feel like Casey Kasem. Okay, yeah. Trying to trying to get you people to figure out this thing, but I can't. Or do I feel like Seacrest? God forbid. I don't know. You want to feel like him? How does it feel to ever. be? Hey, dude, I'll take that bank account. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. You guess? He's such a sellout, though. Dude, I haven't life. had a chance. You know what? I have not had a chance to go on my Seacrest rant yet yeah. since he's single-handedly taken over the world. Yeah. The, Ryan Seacrest is the problem with the media. And here's why he's the problem with the media. If it weren't for Janet Jackson and Justin Timberlake in 2002, we would yeah. not deal with Ryan Seacrest. You know why? Because Everybody goes with his ass because he's safe, he's vanilla, yes. and they know he's not going to say anything or do anything offensive. He's completely uncreative, and he sucks. But he's not going to be able to get those celebrities him. in there. I he, he's him. not going to be able to get those celebrities in there as soon as he kicks them to the curb. I love Howard got Madonna. celebrities in there. Ah, no, but look at what Howard did. Yeah, and he yeah, had, he yeah. had the Howard had a better guest list than Seacrest does. Ah, I hate yeah. Ryan Seacrest. Yeah, I, mean, I hate you. Yeah, but yeah, but Howard would never get like the J Lo's or get like you know. Howard had J Lo in. The uh, Mariah's. Sure he did. Sure he did. Yeah. Absolutely, yeah, Howard yeah, did. Yeah, Howard's yeah. a true champion. Seacrest sucks. I'll okay. still take the you bank account. You and I'll rent. still I know take you the bank account, I dude. Would. I still, seriously, the guy's made an empire for himself. <laughs> All right. Well, you know, we'll sorry, sorry, for the, that. sorry for the Seacrest rant. This should be, I should let you do the ranting. I don't know why I'm the one doing he the should still like, He still has to come out of the closet now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Without a doubt. There is absolutely and unequivocally no question. I'm waiting I don't, for that. I don't know if there's a single person on the planet that goes, no, no. I'm waiting for that. <laughs> I'll still take the bank account, but he needs to come out yeah. of the closet. Uh, <laughs> back to the point at hand, the number one song, the, the most played song ever on this fine, fine radio station, it's actually a cover of a song by Roxette. You're still giving me the deer in the headlights look. Roxette. You don't remember Roxette? Well, I do remember Roxette. It was that blonde chick and that other dude. Listen to your heart. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. This is a, uh, what's my DHT? DHT, the number one song ever. Really? On, I'm not wow. lying. Energy 92.7 okay. and 101.1. Here it is. Holy moly.